Hello YouTube, uh, I know it's been a while since I posted a recent video, but that's because I've been working on multiple things and dropping them. Uh, this consists of making my own type of GUI library to uh, some macros and bots. Um, maybe I'll show them later. <clears throat> but I'm working on a game, and um, I don't have any of the game concepts done yet. Um, the main thing that I have that I'd like to show off right now is um the way that I was able to parse tiled which is not a level editor that I made <coughs> excuse me <coughs> but um it's a really great level editor and it was fairly easy to understand the file format so what I'm going to do right now is make a quick little level and I and yes um I will be using Lucica Mages um resource sheet for this video and uh... yeah Okay, <coughs> so um, basically what, what I did was um, create a simple level. Um, as you can see, I used the um, paint can tool, or the bucket, just to uh, clear the whole thing with grass. And uh, here I made a simple house, I guess, if you would even call it that. <laughs> and uh, I gave it a blue kind of feeling as if, you know, it's like a haunted house. Notice how it's has another layer going on with the different kinds of grass to show that whoever lives here can't cut their grass. But um obviously I'm not trying to make the best level ever. Um basically I'm showing off how you can use um tile sets which is Lucica Mages and um multiple layers as you can see um I use this as the grass layer um, the foreground for the building, and then the foreground too for the things on the building, like the windows and the little hole. And uh, I already saved it, so we're going to go into my project and compile it. As you can see, um, here we have exactly as it looks on Tiled. Um, it loaded the sheet perfectly fine. Um, as you can see, the layers are working. It's in the correct position. Um, the grass, how it's going behind the house instead of in front. So everything seemed to load it perfectly fine, and the reason why there's this black margin over here is because my window is bigger than the tile tiled window. So for a future video, I'll be sure to increase the X grid. But uh, yeah, that's basically what I'm working on. 
I uh, can't wait to implement it into the game that I'm going to be working on, which will be remain nameless, but here's a hint. Um, read the upper left-hand corner. And, uh, yeah, that's pretty much it. Thanks for watching, and uh, I'll be sure to update you when I um, do another thing that's pretty huge.